Hello everyone, in this video, I will show you how to use Tuya application by 4G module, sometimes outside of your house and sometimes in the farm. There is no internet, no Wi-Fi, and no network. At this time, this situation, so you can insert the SIM card, a 4G SIM card. Also can use the internet, remote control relay, and remote monitor your sensor state. Okay, you can see this is a power distribution box and made by this KCH68A4S board that's a ESP32 board and you can see this made by the A4S board and this is the power and brick the power incoming and this is a brick a 4 channel brick that we have used 10 ampere 4 channel and the power in and the power output you can see this cable and connect to this this is together and this is output, uh, this fabric output is to go through this contact. This is DC contact, and the max is support uh, 25 ampere. And this you can see that have connected together the ground. So when this container have output the signal uh, to this point positive and 12 volt, so that the coin, the contact coin. Will be closed and if without the voltage that will be open the contact will be open so you can see here uh, that a network cable ethernet cable have connect with my router and also you can use the wi-fi and this is the power supply 12 volt for the a4s board and this output a digital output just a real output what channel one two three four so that have connect this to this uh, contact coin you can see this clearly uh, that is for load and this is for contact coin that is 12 volt for on and for off and this is the neutral line and the leave line and this is the power supply the power supply uh, neutral line and the leave line and the 12 volt output at right here this DC 12 volt output will go through and for this controller and for this release calm and this is normal open normal open normal open normal open the normal close i have not used i just only use calm and normal open so that can output the 12 volt uh, to this four channel uh, one two three four four channel okay let's test uh, it used by the two year application we can open this smart life Oh, open this to your application so you can press and you will see I have already added this A4S board to this to your application so we can click and you can see that have four channel relay we can see I can click it on click it on 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 this sound from this contact and also we can press or off and this is or on or off Okay, now I will disconnect the network cable and without Wi-Fi, without the Ethernet, I will show you how to use by the 4G. Now you can see I can power off and disconnect this network cable. And open this box. Okay, you can see here, that is the 4G module we have plugged into the socket and we can install this SIM card at here, you can see, I can install it here. Now I get one my SIM card from my iPhone. So you can see, just use the mobile phone SIM card. And get out of mobile phone. Okay, this SIM card you can see here. But this SIM card is very small. If I install it directly, it's too small. So I need to use this adapt. So you can see here. Use use this adapt just that, like this. And now you can see I can put this SIM card at here. Press it and close it. Just close it, okay? 
And the next, we need to install this antenna. And this antenna, you can use the extender antenna, very long cable, so, yeah, so that you can install this antenna outside of your power distribution box. So this is just a demo. I just connect with it. This is LTE that's used by the 4G signal. And this is GPS for GPS signal. Now we can close this cover. Okay, we can put this antenna at here. Actually, you can use a big antenna or long antenna outside of this box. We need to configure the settings. So the first, we need to connect with the Ethernet cable and the power on. Uh, this is our KCS firmware for the SA4S. So I need to log in. And here you can see that we have set this to your information. Uh, this I have already set it. I just need to enable this GPS function so that I can use a mobile phone and remote control the Tuya board of by 4G. But before you enable it, we need to config the network for the GSM module. You can see here, the first step, we need to enable this GSM module. So I need to enable it and click save. Then the website, the system will be re reboot. Okay, after you reboot, you can refresh uh, this reboot successfully. Then you can choose this default is SIM 76000. You can input this my mobile phone number and you need to add this country code and add it to your mobile phone number. So you can click phone test and make a call. You can click this make a call. You can see successfully and wait for a moment. And my mobile phone. This is the board have telephone, this telephone number. And the next we can send a short message for a test. You can click send a message. You can click. Okay. Now you can see uh, uh, this is a test message from the A4S board. Uh, this is Kinkuni controller because I have saved this number Kinkuni controller by this SIM card. So now you can receive the call and receive the short message. So the 4G module is working well. Okay, after we test the GSM module, we can click port and click to ya. And this time you just enable this button very easy and press save and system reboot. After reboot, we need to wait about uh, three minutes. Then we click the monitoring. And you will see uh, this GPS is connected. Uh, this means that I have connected with your Tuya color server. Now we can test this Tuya application. And you can see this is our Tuya application. This time I will disconnect the network cable. Okay, you can see no Wi-Fi, no Ethernet. Now only work by this 4G module. And here you can see that I can press this controller. You can see, press, this will be on. Press the second, and the third, and the fourth. So, or off, and press, or on. So now you can see this controller have connected the Tuya color server by the 4G module. My mobile phone uses Wi-Fi. I can also disable the Wi-Fi. You can see, I can disable the Wi-Fi so that you can see I have used 5G. And you can click, also can turn off, 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 off. So this time, this power distribution box is work with the 4G by the GSM. And my mobile phone is worked by the 5G so that all used by the SIM card uh, for communication. So you can install this power distribution box in anywhere. Just insert the SIM card and you can use your mobile phone just to have the internet. You can remote country in anywhere. So this can feedback the state where I turn off. 
the feedback, the state. Okay, this is the solution for the 4G module for this two-year application. Thanks for watching.